posting this video on Inauguration Day, on uh, January 20th. Because, let's be honest, with everything going on and with everything that's happened in the past year, we need a fresh start. We need a new change. And what better thing to do that than a new presidency? And with Biden taking back America and helping to start off 2021 right, I figured, hey, since he's starting off 2021 right, why not start off today right? The same way. So, so I thought, hey, why not start off this very important day of this year with the first thing I did on the first day of this year? And that was make this. So, yeah. I'm not sure if you guys have seen this yet, but this is basically the omelette that I helped my uncle to create uh, for our breakfast on January 1st. And while it was just a simple omelette, just put in some alfredo, put in some mushrooms, add some vegetables, all that kind of stuff. While it was just there, it was delicious, it was good, it was godly, like, oh my god, I love it. And I figured, why not have the perfect breakfast, or at least in my opinion, for this very perfect day? So yeah, long story short, if you guys want to see me recreate this special omelette that me and my uncle made uh, back on New Year's Day, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and then comment down below what you want to see me make next time. Now I should probably get cooking because it's already breakfast time. So, yeah, let's get to cooking. Now obviously, to make a mushroom alfredo, whatever it's called, omelette, the first thing you're gonna need is mushrooms, which I already started cooking a little bit before uh, I start recording. So, yeah, for this mushroom alfredo omelet, you're gonna need a mushroom, some scallions, some salt and pepper, some alfredo sauce and of course as the name suggests some eggs to make the omelette so yeah since this is technically my actual breakfast I should probably get to cook it Oh, and yes, we are going to do this in honor of the inauguration that is coming up on January 20th, which is, of course, as I said, when I'm going to be posting this video. So, yeah, we're going to make sure we. So, yeah, we're going to make sure we have this video in honor of being able to stay true to the red, white, and blue. Others, staying true to the real America, you know, before stuff that I don't want to talk about happened. So yeah, while Biden's working on getting back on track with this, time for me to get back on track 
with all this. So with that said, let's get cooking.
Huh. Construction crew. Anyways. This is the Mushroom Alfredo Omelette. Hopefully it goes Okay. Look at that. Isn't that great? Wait, let me turn on the light. see a little paper rolling. Okay. You can tell that it's hot. Because you can tell that it's steaming. Indeed. So yeah. This. So yeah. This is the mushroom helmet that I made with my uncle back on New Year's Day. So yeah. Like what else can I say? It's a perfect breakfast party. Perfect day. And arguably one of the most important days considering all that has happened last year. So we're not even gonna think about that because now we can now focus on this as well as the inauguration. That's gonna be sometime later today or whenever I post this video. But anyways, yeah. <laughs> This is the mushroom omelet. Now, time for a taste test. Let's get into it. Let's see if. Oh, wait, I should take a picture of this first. Okay. And, don't want to do that. Oof, oof, no. First bite of the day. Here we go. Just fell all over my suit. Um. Mmm. Loving the cheese or the Alfredo and the um, the scallions and the onion went really well. With the mushroom. Yeah, I would say this kind of is just like the mushroom omelette my uncle made. Yeah, so I think this was actually a success. Because if you look at this and look at that, you can tell that it's somewhat the same. Obviously, I was planning on doing a whole breakfast, like, you know, have some sausage, maybe some bacon. But the time is right now 10.30, and I have a busy day ahead of me. Uh, and once again, it's MLK Day. It's not really Inauguration Day. But I'm pretty sure Joe Biden has a busy day after today, so. <laughs> yeah. I don't think Joe Biden would see this, but if you do see this somehow uh thank you for everything you've done in terms of winning the election and winning over america because let's be honest we need that new sense of leadership of we need that new sense of leadership we need that new sense of freedom and having a correct way of political justice because 2020 has really been a terrible way to start a new decade. And I'm trusting that you and Vice President-elect Kamala Harris will do everything in your power to get America back on track. Uh, so with that said, thank you Joe Biden for everything you have done and will do. And yeah, I hope you can become the president we deserved uh, and yeah, I hope you become the president we deserved and that you become the president we need because we need a president now more than ever. 
So yeah, if you guys like this video, go ahead, smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below what you want to see me make next time. So yeah, with that said, I'm going to continue to eat this delicious omelet. Uh, but anyways, hope you guys have a great day today, especially you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, y'all, and good day to you, Mr. President and Vice President of the United States of America.